This is a very quick tutorial on how to connect make.com to WordPress. So I'm going to select WordPress here. If you don't see it, then just press the plus and type Word. And I'm going to select create a post. So when you're creating a post, you need to actually connect it to a website. You can call this what you want. I'm just going to keep this as my WordPress connection. I've created a test site that we can test this all out on. So you need to actually install a plugin on your WordPress site to connect using make.com. So go to your plugins, select add new plugin, and then simply type make connector. Oh, I didn't spell that right. Make connector. And you'll see here, make connector. Install now and then activate. Okay. Make connector is activated. On the left hand side, you'll see the make option. Okay, so we have an API key set up here. You simply need to copy the API key into the API key field here. And then you need to add your URL. So your URL is your website URL as you see at the top here, and then type WP JSON. And make sure to add the forward slash at the end. Okay, then press save and then it should test the connection. We have some test categories here and they're showing up fine for that. So that's good. So I'm just going to start with a test. I'll just say test article is a title, uh, content is test. I'm going to select host as the type and that should be everything for now. I'm going to right click and select run this module only. And so I'm just trying to test the creation of a new article just to make sure that this is actually working. Okay, so I've gone to my WordPress test site and now we see this test article. I'm gonna click preview and there we go. So we have test article and test. We use this WordPress connector a lot in our automation. So check out the link in the description to our main channel where you can see some more examples.